Well, whoa. Welcome, 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 YouTube number eight. Eight on the climb, eight or nine. It's Assassin's Creed 3. It's our first big triple A title on this joyous journey that we're going through right now. So it's a game that I've never played. I've played most of the Assassin's Creed, including Black Flag, so I kind of skipped number three. I heard it wasn't that good. I heard it was like a pretty much a carbon copy of Assassin's Creed Brotherhood or whatever that other one was called with Ezio. So I kind of skipped it, never played it, but for the sake of the climb, let's give it a go. So I am quite a big. Whoa, no. I don't want to do that. Thank you, kind game. I am quite a big fan of, of Assassin's Creed games, especially Black Flag. It is the, one of the best games of all time. You're just a pirate running around. This game, in principle, I like the sound of. You're a Native American. You get to the, go around with a tomahawk and just merc people. I don't know what merc means, but I think it means kill. Um, so that, that should be a good thing. So without further ado, let's jump into the single player. Alright, so apparently I have played it before. Uh, let's delete this one. Left control, delete. Ah, oh, but if I've got to start as Desmond, that'll be so destroying. Uh, no, not Desmond. Tom Muck Gaming McGurk. Yes. Too long. Let's go Muck Gaming. For the win. Used to be when people talked about the end of the world, we locked them up or laughed them off. Sometimes both. Um, so, there's some backstory to Assassin's Creed. This dude is called Desmond. He was in a thing called an Animus. He could go back in time and he could be different people, which was all cool and stuff. He got to be um, Ezio in the second game and the guy whose name I can't remember in the first game. Running around, stabbing people with those tall, jewelry thingy, Majibi, saving the world. But ultimately, it's about the Templars versus the assassins. The worst thing about Assassin's Creed is this. It's the backstory in the real world that no one really cares about. All I want to do is be an assassin. I want to run around and stab people in the face. I don't care about apples or big things leading up to this. All I care about is being a Native American with a tomahawk who can dice people's faces off to release my pent-up inner rage. I had an awkward childhood. Um, one that I don't want to talk about on stream. Not even this is stream, on, on YouTube where bad things happen, I, you know, I don't, I don't want to go through in great detail. But that's why I like these kind of games, just a joke by the way, I thought it was fine. I like these games so I can go ahead and just randomly stab people in the face, but I can't do that if there's a giant cutscene at the start that explains five previous games worth of backstory. Given that I only plan on playing this for like 15 minutes, the first 15 minutes are going to be us learning about the Animus, which is going to make Assassin's Creed 3 the worst video of all time. So please, for the love of God, stop talking. Stop talking about bodies and minds and a giant sword and a Super Bowl ring. And let's just get on with this. <gasps> They're all Hitman! They've hired Agent 47! Agent 47 has crossed over genres and he's now in Assassin's Creed as well. Yes, the world's blowing up. Look, flashing lights. We've got to stop these things. It's everyone's last stand, alright? It's just everyone's last stand. It's still going. Desmond Tutu. What's he going to do? Is he going to save the world? Or is he going to fail miserably? Please hurry up. For this is really starting to kill me now. There he is. Looking substantially less cool than his two forefathers. In that he's wearing a hoodie. And they're wearing actual assassin shit. He's having a casual drink. As you can see I've gone for the, uh, the champagne flute with water in. Um, as that's how classy I am. It's either that or I haven't been asked to wash up for the past. Ah! It's attacking the microphone with the water. Get away, water! Or oh, I couldn't be asked. Oh, that's the alien lady. She's vaguely important. She was saying, no, the world's going to end. We're all going to die. Let's do stuff. Please hurry up. I think we're nearly there. We're in a long, dark passage, which is what she said. Hopefully we can leave this long, dark passage. And we can just carry on playing. Altair! And we can just carry on playing the game. He's having a casual drink now. Mm. Got to hydrate. I'm now fully hydrated and ready to game. Look at the apple. Look at me hold the apple of the world. Yeah. Alright, let's start on the back of a van. Like all good stories start in the back of a van. I say stories. That's how all good court cases start normally. Uh, I put her in the van. Yes. I can't remember any of these characters. It's been so long since I played. 
All I know is that one of the guys used to be on British TV, but he's not anymore. Come now, Desmond. Leave the van, and let's go stab things. Ah, uh, yes. The old secluded cave. No one will ever notice that. No one will ever notice the brand new car parked outside the secluded cave. Whenever I hide, I hide a lot. I mean, I'm a, I'm a hider. Love a good bit of hiding. Like a young Anne Frank. I don't type, though. It's too noisy. I hide in caves. Oh, here we go. Yep. Dum, da, dum, da, da. Just slowly walking forward. Let's go. Random new guy carrying boxes. Desmond, you're lazy. Go and get a box. Go on, cut her up, 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 cut her up. Get in her way. Push her into the wall. Yes, block her. Block her. <laughs> it's like Lady Dota. Block her. Block the creeps. Block the creeps. Creeps one. He's got like a really awkward swagger. So this is what I don't like about these kind of games. I've been playing for like five, ten minutes now. I haven't done anything other than walk forward for all of four seconds. I just want to do shit. I want to climb things. I want to be an assassin. I don't want to be a mediocre developer, which he quite clearly is, who's putting holes into walls. Yes, things are going to happen. The door's going to open. It's all going to be amazing. Just please hurry up and let me play. Ah, the old rabbit hole reference. I don't care how we get out. I just want to go through. Oh, oh, under we go, under we go. Win. Okay. Stuff's happening. I can walk. I still can't run. I now transferring somewhere else. This is this is this is bizarre. I appreciate everyone who's going to be angry about this. There's a huge amount of backstory to this, but this is kind of boring. Especially when all you're doing on a YouTube video is a 15 minute playthrough of the first 15 minutes, which apparently are all cutscenes. This is like watching a shit movie. With a 50 year old Robert Downey Jr. I'm aware he's probably already. F oh, I've lost my light! Go get it back! Get the light! Come here, light! Alright. Sliding down there again. Shh! No sliding. Why can't I run? Is there a run button? Ah, there is! Right. It's run. My bad. I could run all along. Normally, like. Oh, there's an animus. Normally, like, left shift is run, but apparently not in this. This is kind of cool now. We've got a weird cube. A fluorescent Rubik's Cube, which I saw Justin Bieber do the other day. I was surprised and somewhat mesmerized that Justin Bieber, who was like, baby, 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 uh -huh, can do a Rubik's Cube in such quick time. The man's obviously not that dumb. Well, he can't be that dumb. He's made tons of money, so he can't be that dumb. Because he does some very silly things sometimes, okay? Beeb, if you're listening, my friend, just just chill out with the craziness. Just relax the craziness, and all is going to be well, my friend. Cool. There's a hall lighting. This is looking very pretty. There we go. See, what do adding some drama to the story. It's all epic, things are lighting up, we can crack on and get in the animus and do stuff that's actually vaguely useful. I just want to fight someone. That's all I want to do. On the bright side, Black Flag is next on my list, and I have completed that. So because I have completed that, it won't be from the beginning. You must find the key. Find the key, Desmond. Son. That's cool. Here we go again. Embrace it, Desmond. Embrace it. Desmond? You hear us? I hear you. Yeah. What happened? I decided to give him a cooler voice rather than his normal one. So naturally, he dropped me in the animus instead of, I know, making sure I was okay. Uh, he's now like Batman. It's like a young Batman. Oh, you grab your wrist. The old grab the wrist run. Grabbing the wrist. Grabbing the wrist. Running around and I'm grabbing the wrist. 
This is clearly loaded, so please just send me somewhere else. I still haven't found what I'm looking for. I'm looking to fight someone. That hasn't happened yet. Come on. Running around in a circle. Running around. Oh, stop running. Keep going in a circle. Do you know, Dad? Ah, I do know. Did you did do you did you know? I I do know. Do you know? I I do know. Okay. That works for me. Let's test. Don't want any bugs. All right. I'm walking there. I, I I've already figured that out. Thank you, game. We're twenty fucking minutes in. I've already figured out how to run. Yes, yes, keep going. Okay, look at me go, I'm climbing, I'm a ninja. See, I don't wanna, I don't want to play as Desmond. Desmond's so lame. He's the lamest human, but at least the climb mechanics look alright. Spider Desmond, Spider Desmond does whatever a Spider Desmond does. Spin a web anytime. Press run button and die. <laughs> okay, that was my bad. Desmond, I'm sorry. Please forgive me, Desmond. Please forgive me. Let me go. It's just that I'm bored of playing as you already. This has always been Assassin's Creed's biggest issue. Is they introduced a character that no one ever really cared about. Because all everyone wants to be is a freaking assassin. No one wants to be some random guy who's got ancestors and heritage. We've all got that. We've all got past. No one really cares that much. Halfway synced. Keep going, Desmond. Keep going. No, up here, my friend. Up here. Good. There you go. Now you're a baller. Now you're a boss. Now you own DOS. Keep going. And again. Big leap. Big slide. Big run. Straight up there. Yep. Okay. All right, Desmond. Follow the on-screen instructions and kill the two Templars. How do I lock onto them? I am pressing left click. Dear game, I am pressing left. I'm pressing it. Aha! Maybe that's why. There you go. The old punch to the back of the head, or the back of the back. All right. Yep, let's swing, then you can go off. Ah, oh, fail. I have failed at life. We're at the very start, and I have failed. Instead, I will just break you like a human being. Go, go, go. Keep going. Oh, new crazy spin. I've not seen that in Assassin's Creed game before. That was sick. Where are we going? Up there? Okay, let's go up there. No, Desmond. No, Desmond. Naughty Desmond. Desmond, up. Desmond, no. De Desmond, Desmond. Desmond, jump. There's a, there's a good boy. Over here, Desmond. This way. Yes, and again. Yes, now you're getting it. Now you're an assassin. Now you're a ninja. You're a ninja assassin warrior now, Desmond. Oh my, will you, will you please stop doing that? Please stop jumping over everything, you fucked hard. No, come on. I need to jump, Desmond. There you, there's a good lad. There you go, he's getting there. Desmond's getting the hang of this. See, Ezio or Altair, we've done this by now, but Desmond's slow. Takes him a while. That's a roof, that's a roof, that's a roof, that's a roof, that's a chimney, that's falling down. Haha, <laughs> I'm a pirate! I'm not a pirate. I have a fuck all idea what I am. I appear to be some sort of person in the army? A Spanish dude, perhaps? I can't run. So let's slowly together walk through the animus and not actually do anything in-game. That's what I really enjoy doing in life. I enjoy walking really slowly 
in a straight line for no apparent reason. Hello, 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 how are you? Nice to see you. I'm just preoccupied, that's all. Just a little preoccupied. Oh, just keep walking in a straight line as we build the world around us really slowly. Oh, this could be a thing. We could very soon be transported to the world that I actually want to play in. Yep, let's start that. Kind of Covent Garden. Shall I, take your coat? I do like Covent Garden. I'm going there pretty soon, actually. Going to the girlfriend in Covent Garden. We're going to go to the gym first. <coughs> then Covent Garden. Alright. I can arrange that. This is quite cool. So this is not at all what I was expecting. Just if they could have started this slightly quicker, that would have been good. Thank you. I've never had a marker before to find my seat. <laughs> it's like a whole new side quest. How many people can you annoy was getting to your seat? I'm I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, I'm sorry. I didn't see you there. My bad. Evening, Haytham. Evening, Haytham. I've used to it before once. My father brought me here as a child. I remember little of it. I don't suppose tonight will afford me the. Hmm. It would appear there's going to be some killing very soon. Where are you, sir? Looking for the gold target. If anyone sees a gold target, just let me know. He was there for ages. I could see that, but the game wouldn't focus on him. You'll need to find another way up. I'm going to guess we're going to climb. We're going to climb up very slowly and very stealthily. Alright. Excuse me. Sorry. I apologies. Don't mind me. Sorry. Stay there, sir. Coming through. Don't mind me. Thank you. Thank you kindly. You are a very kind man. Just gonna casually walk over here. No one's gonna notice me walking over here. And then climbing a ladder. Climb the climb it. Yes, just keep 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 climbing. Why have you stopped climbing? Why whoa, camera angle. What are you doing there, camera angle? Go up. Okay. This is this is now becoming No, you can't go out there. This is retarded. Are you genuinely telling me no one's going to notice this? Surely everyone's going to notice some random guy just climbing... Don't, don't mind me! No one look up! If anyone looks up, you'll see things that you shouldn't. Just going to casually climb around here. No one look, and you'll never see. Go higher. Go higher up. This is so special. This is the worst, like, look. They're all down there. One person would definitely look up. The play can't be that good. But we'll ignore that for the time being. We'll ignore that and we'll carry on climbing around this theatre. We're going to climb all the way around. Go up here. Sneak behind the maid and stab the guy in the back. Wonderful. Find a way backstage. Okay. Please don't be, don't be a side game. Don't be a side game. Oh, it's a side game. I worry there are going to be way too many of those in this game. That sort of thing is always completely pointless. It doesn't really add any value to the game. Oh, I'm picking a lock. Yep, yeah, keep going, keep going. A little bit of Dutch courage, eh? 
So that's what backstage looks like. It looks very similar to front of stage, just darker. I've never been backstage before. Anyway, let's keep going. But I don't think we're actually going to get any gameplay as the, as the main character in this game, which is a shame. Um, I'm going to go up here. Let's go rest this way. Lovely. Fly me to the moon. Let me sing amongst them stars. Little song for you there related to the moon. So let's carry on sneaking around here. No one's going to see me. Ain't no one seeing no me. Mm -mm. Keep going around here. So we've done very well. Let's take stock of what we've managed to achieve so far. We've managed to crawl the whole way around in plain view, plain sight of our entire theatre into this guy's chamber where we're going to casually stab him in the back, I imagine. That's socially awkward. Alright, so I just stabbed some dude pretty casually in front of a child, which is nice, and now I'm leaving. Uh, if I no, don't run, just casually walk out. The old fast paced walk will do it. They'll never suspect a thing. Alright, I was wrong. They've suspected a thing. They're aware <laughs> that someone's died. Seize him! Seize him! Yeah, come, come on now, you're an assassin. You can get past some random men. There you go. There's a clever man. I see you have the intellect of Desmond, which is fantastic. Why are you walking this far around? There must be an easier way out. As a get her about, it's probably the man we saw hanging off of the wall earlier in the theatre. We thought it was all part of the act. We were mistaken. I kind of want to carry on playing now to find out what's happening here. But I really can't be asked. See, this is what Assassin's Creed is good at. We're back in, in 17, whatever it was, in London. I feel like I'm immersed in the environment, which is awesome. I don't want to play as Desmond. Desmond breaks my soul. No one cares about the modern day. I live in that. This is what it's all about. Keep going. Find your way out. Alright. Imagine that I'm now back as Desmond. I'm not. I'm going into a casual cart. Horse and carriage, sir. Yes, please. Take me to Stringfellows. To fleet and bride. By your, command. By your command, sir. I'm guessing I found the key, though, right? Yes! But I have no idea what happens next. Gentlemen, I hold in my hand a key. And if this book is to be believed... It will open the doors... Okay, so this wasn't too bad. But it's very, very cutscene heavy, right? I am quite bored already of this. It's cool being an assassin, wandering around and just stabbing things with your stabby blades. What isn't cool is hundreds and hundreds of hours of talking when you're making a very short video. But, with that said, I think we can say Assassin's Creed 3 looks very similar to all the other Assassin's Creed games. So, if you do enjoy Assassin's Creed, you can get this for like two pounds on G2A or a pound fifty from a local market. You can probably sell them a turnip and a salmon, and in return they'll provide you with a Steam key for this. Um, but I'm gonna leave it at that. I'm gonna say 
Thank you very, very much indeed for watching. It's been an honour and a privilege casting for you, mighty fan people as always. Uh, like it, subscribe, follow me on Twitter. I will be putting things on there. It'll be insightful, intellectual, and that all could be a lie. But as I said, it'll be an absolute pleasure. Uh, and speak to you, mighty fine people of YouTube, very soon. Peace up, A Town Down. Yeah, yeah!